Towards enhancing the quality of victim protection supports, the action against trafficking in persons and smuggling of migrants in Nigeria at Ipsum has provided needs-based facilities by refurbishing 11 shelters meant for the rehabilitation and stabilization of victims of trafficking. Atipsom team leader, Mr. Rafael Rios Molina, during a press briefing with journalist in Abuja, explained that the efforts which is funded by the European Union and implemented by the International Bureau American Foundation for Administration and Public Policy, FIAP, is to give a better life to victims. So the activity of the shelters has been started two years ago in different phases. Uh, first, the assessment, the technical assessment that we did it, always with the support of the NACTIF and the representative of NACTA, because has been a, 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 a real challenge for all of us. No? We would like to have in many shelters, we would like to go to many other places in Nigeria, because the objective is to provide a better service, a better uh, quality for the people who are there in that shelters. The National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Person says concerted effort is needed to combat the scourge of trafficking. The phenomenon of human trafficking itself, to effectively address it, you must focus more on the victims. It has to be victim-centered. Because when these uh, victims are rescued, they need to be properly rehabilitated, they need to be empowered, they need to be integrated. But before you do all this, they need shelter. Shelter is key. The Nigeria Police Force stressed the need for increased sensitization against trafficking to avoid vicious cycle that may truncate the efforts of stakeholders. Many of the people that were trafficked and rescued and even rehabilitated with the afan going back to the to the problem again. In that case. Continuous sensitization is important. The 11 shelters refurbished in 2021 include Makadi Zono Command Shelter, Kano Zono Command Shelter, Sokoto Zono Command Shelter, Imano World Children Foundation, the Ark Children Home, Robot Homes and Skills Acquisition Center, La Vie Mode's Global Mission, also known as Living World Mission, Daughters of Abraham Foundation Abuja, Galilee Shelter Ibadan, Watcliffe Shelter Abuja, Safety Children Initiative Ilela Sokoto Fapak Shelter Ibadan. Their intervention cut across the whole of Nigeria. The shelter refurbishment cut across the northern part of Nigeria and the southern part of Nigeria, not just the Federal Capital Territory as the case used to be. So they went around with us, with our social workers, with our shelter officers and the officer in charge of this project to look at the shelter. The shelter refurbishment will improve the life of over 500 victims of human trafficking. Uluwatobi Eniton, Viable TV.